Uh, my name is Laverne Shep, and uh, our farm name is LNS Farms. Uh, currently, we're milking about 118 cows. Uh, we have about 150 total with dry cows and everything. Uh, cow traffic that we have is uh, milk first. Well, the VMS, after seeing how they op operate it, uh, I could see it did a decent job of milking. Um, so I wasn't worried about the milking procedure part. I guess the main thing, I'm, after looking at the systems, as long as you set up your cow flows and that right, I, I could see it would work. So I guess that's the reason why we went with the VMS. Our milk quality, um, I mean, currently right now our cell count's between 150 to 200 cell count. Um, which before it usually was like 200 to 250, so it has come down. And I guess, you know, what I tell a lot of people with robots, whatever you're currently at right now with your herd, it's not going to get worse. It should improve. So I guess, you know, I, I would not, definitely not be scared of putting robots in and thinking your herd's going to go backwards, and not, you know, because you should be able to improve from where you're at, or at least maintain what you have. Well, the features that the, that the, the VMS has, which I like for the for the herd health, you know, like the cleaning part that has actual the, the teacups that, that go onto the coders and actually wash them and dry them and, you know, takes a strip of milk out. It actually does a very good job of cleaning, you know, each cow. That part I really like about that, you know, that feature of that. Um, the method of the, of the way it cleans I, versus the other brands that I looked at. Just watching the other brand and this one, this one just does a better job cleaning. And you can have settings on there. You can do a light wash, medium, or a heavy wash. So you can adjust all that to what you want for your, you know, for your cows. Yeah, the way when this cow, when the cow was done milking on, you know, when she's completely done milking, I like the fact that it pulls the the, the cleaner, not the cleaner, but the inflation's up and they're upside down, and it does a rinse in between each one. I, I just think that part it just seems looks cleaner, you know, versus where the other ones are always sticking straight up. You know, that that's the difference between the machines that I've seen. The health of the cow, I guess. You know, no, no, knowing with the gate system that we have, or not even even having a gate system, but I, I can see right away if a cow hasn't come in to get milked, you know. And if, with the incomplete, you know, if there's any cows that are on the incomplete that it's not normal, I can definitely go check them right away. So, I mean, it, you know instantly if something's not quite right with a cow. And also it has the MDI numbers it gives you. That's another indicator. And it also it even tells you if there's blood in the milk, and you can set those um, parameters where if, if the number goes so high it'll just automatically dump the milk for you and not go into the tank which definitely helps with the, the quality of the milk. If somebody would ask me if I recommend them to other farmers it's almost a no-brainer. I yeah definitely recommend them. Um, honestly you know if somebody's thinking about putting a parlor and I can understand if you have plenty of help and you can always get the help you know it, it might be the way to go but I for the future I see this not ever changing. I mean, this is the way to go, definitely.